Hi everyone. Uh, welcome to the Gacha Memories Redo of 2024. Um, this video is gonna be uploaded like an hour late. Like it started, it just started at 11:01 and it's gonna end at 11:31 because I waited a whole hour for my stepdad about my uh, haircut. And so far, SML has not yet uploaded. What a surprise there, huh? Maybe by the time this video uploads, probably by the time I'm done with this video, I suppose SML might upload right under my nose, like he always does. So, I just want to get this thing done. I probably... I don't know if I want to do a Saturday night edition of Bachelor Memories Redo of 2024. But, uh, I don't know. Heck, I, for, I don't remember what I did, what we did last week. I think... I guess Mitsuko wanted to marry me, but we're... Mitsuko and I are, uh, are an item on this sto in this storyline now. Jeez, I lost it. My memory was about to fade. <laughs> but, uh, let's see. What was my, what was my, uh, what was my previous? Oh, we were, oh, we learned that Looney had a fanboy in. Other, and all that other stuff. Anyway, let's just let's just get started. We're already wasting time. Multi slash. Huh? Huh? Suko, I mean, shoot, Travis, behind you. Oh goodness, the fatigue is already setting in. Look, I look behind me and I see a black skier charging up its laser eye attack. After that, I won't let you. She absolutely destroyed that skier with a single attack. I smiled at myself. She is even fiercer while protecting me now. And her attacks are much more vicious too. Alright, enemies cleared. We arrived at the centermost point. Activating Buck Fixer. <laughs> Initializing Fixing Tool. I'm sorry, I, I laugh so much. I don't know why I laugh every time I sound like a freaking robot. Initial <laughs> Initializing Fixing Tool. Normalizing space time breach. Space time anomaly sealed. Why is that why is that funny to me? I don't know why that's so funny. Alright, dear. We did it. That's, indeed we did. Mitsuko ran up to me and <laughs> hugged me again. Mitsuko ran up to me and hugged me again. <laughs> yes. That was easy. She then started raining kisses on my face. <laughs> oh, that is so good. That is, that, that is, that is really good, to be honest with you. I mean, it's real good. You were so cool today, too. Destroying waves upon waves of those cubes with a single wave of your sword. You didn't even evoke anyone today. No, I didn't. Hmm. 
Misuko, <laughs> stop. This is embarrassing. Both of us started laughing as we frolicked. Frolicked. Why do I keep saying frolicked for? That's so oh, stupid. It's frolicked together in celebration of another victory against the bugs. Those past few weeks, ever since our first night together, have been some of the best weeks of my life. Sure, there was the occasional close call from being swarmed by a bigger anom by the bigger anomalies, but it was fun. This time together with Mitsuko, going on dates, kissing, holding hands, sleeping, cuddling. I've grown to love my girlfriend's fluffiness. And she also didn't seem to mind providing me with fluff. Uh, absolutely. I'm quite happy with her. We managed to seal off most of the anomalous areas in England, surprisingly enough, and even have enough free time to play around together. This is bliss. The happiness that I want to protect at all costs. This was the penultimate one. There is only one anomaly left in all of England. Even greater news, even greater news is that, whew, is that Looney told us yesterday that Lilith and Ellie managed to seal off all the breaches in Brazil. And that the people she recruited managed to seal all others over the world without any loss. Even against the greater anomalies, there was only some who were wounded, but they still managed to win. And then went around sealing off the remaining anomalies all over the world. In short, there is only one single anomaly left in the entire world. I take Mitsuko by the waist, giving her a big grin. This is good. This is feeling so good. We're doing it, Mitsuko. We are almost all done with those creepy bugs. Haha, <laughs> yes. I can't wait to be done with them. Man, I am having, man, I am having some frick ton of, I am having a frick ton of fun with her, am I? <laughs> hey, you two. It seems like you see a lot of this anomaly. Great work. Thanks, Looney. Much appreciated. We heard Looney's voice in our ears. And paid attention. Although we didn't let each other go. <laughs> we didn't let each other go. We didn't. There is a single small anomaly left. It's the last one in the whole world. Can't believe we got so far so luck so quickly on I me. Mean. Louis sounded ecstatic at our success. Do you think you two can go over there right now? The sooner we finish this, the better. Sure. Absolutely, Looney. We'll get right on it. I agree. We barely put effort in, in this one. I think we can afford one last... anticlimactic battle. What do you think, Chico? I think we can do it. Let's go. Let's go already, so we can finally finish this farce and cuddle all night. <laughs> oh man, I love it. I love it. I really do. You two are quite the happy couple, huh? Yes. Yes, Looney, we are the happiest couple. It's exactly what I deserve. Seems Looney hurt that. 
course he did. Yes, we. Yes, we are. <laughs> I see. Just head over there sometime today, I'll hide. Leave me out. We got it. We got it, Lena. With that, Lena's voice stopped sounding in our ears. I also felt her presence re recede. So, should we head over there now? Of course. But first... I think we can afford to celebrate a little right now. But there's no one here. The bugs are gone. Oh man, we're gonna have a- we're, we're gonna have another moment. I know that for a fact. We're gonna have another moment. I embrace her close to my body. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, that feels good. You are quite the clingy fox, you know that? I can't help it. I just want to make up for centuries without contact or affection. This is my, and as my lover, you are the perfect person for that. This is finally what I'm going for. This is, this is finally what I'm going after. <laughs> Very well. Close your eyes, my cute little fox. Once again, as it did several times those last weeks, my lips meet with hers. We made out. Let's see. I can quite confidently say, at this point, I'm completely smitten by this fox goddess. I want nothing more than to be happy with her. To make her happy. Good. That's good. My answer to her question is already clear, but I'll wait for a while. I want it to be a surprise for her after all. But for the moment, I have more important matters to take to take care of. Ugh. I think we're, I think we're reaching the, I think we're reaching the near end of this. This must be where the, where that, where this, that happens. I'm, I'm not spoiling it, but this is where that moment happens. After staying in our hotel for a while to rest, Mitsuko and I arrived at our destination. The city center in the middle of the night, surprisingly, there is no one here, but even so, Misuko went through the trouble of making a large barrier around the whole area to make people suddenly want to go somewhere else if they approach. Oh yeah, that spell that she, oh that spell that she casted. Even if this, even if this is a small anomalous area, even if this is the last one, any and all precautions should be taken. We are at the very border. A few more steps and we will enter it. Are you ready, Travis? Yes, indeed, Misuko. I grin confidently at her. More ready than ever.
Both of us take another step into the city. Center. Ready for whatever glitch monster we may encounter. Just like always, and for the last time, the perception of reality is turned upside down. We are, we are here, Travis. England is the world's last anomalous area. Yes, indeed it is. Yes, let's go, dear. We walk forward, following the UGPS. It's a signal to the centermost part of this anomaly. This is str this is strange. Hmm? Not a single bug appeared yet. Yeah, that is yeah, that is pretty true. No one came yet. This happened a few times already. Well, sometimes the bugs just don't appear and on others, the anomaly seals itself off after a while. Maybe this is what's happening right now. Maybe this is what is happening right now. I don't know, it sounds far too convenient. Really? Well, it is this very last anomaly, and very small one, at that. See? We are already in the center. I was already expecting it to be anticlimactic. Even so. Anyway, let's just get this over with. I take one bug fixer on my from my backpack and press the button. Huh? The bug fix the bug fixer disintegrated in my hands. This could be it. I look at Mitsuko. What? Yeah. Her face. Her whole entire face. It's missing. M Mitsuko? What? What happened to her? Why is her face gone? Is this where that? Is this where that spam comes around? Another Mitsuko suddenly appeared in my field of vision. What is this trickery? Travis, what's wrong? Ah, crap. Here we go again with this. Ah, jeez. They both say that at the same time, and I can only watch stunned in silence. What? What? Yet another one! Oh god. Travis, what's wrong? Travis, what's wrong? Travis, what's wrong? <laughs> ah, jeez. Here goes, here we go again. Am I... dreaming? Travis, what's wrong? Travis, Travis, what's wrong? What's wrong? Travis, what, Travis, what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Oh my god, this is happening. I can't believe this is actually happening right now. What's wrong? 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 
Oh, yeah, it is. It's that social media spam. Just like in the second series with Looney and Lilith. Holy heck. What the crap is going on? What's wrong? <laughs> What's wrong? What's wrong? Oh, man. It, this is insanity. What's wrong? 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 Oh, jeez. Oh my God, this is ha- I can't believe this. I'm actually going through this again. Ah, ah. <laughs> what is this madness? Is this a nightmare? Summon Yung, the one, the protector of my dreams. Please help. She, she would be able to instantly make this nightmare stop. Where is she? She's not being summoned right now. Why isn't it working? Curses. All right. All right. Just close your eyes. Close your eyes. Ignore the madness all over you. And it will be gone. I close my eyes. And eventually, I can hear all the warped voices of my lover disappearing. I will it away. I will this nightmare away. And then... And then what happens next is gonna is gonna shock you. So prepare yourselves. I open my eyes. Hey? Wow. I am holding my sword. What? And an act comes up. It didn't happen again. And it's stained with blood. Oh my god. Travis. I hear a familiar and feeble voice calling out to me. I turn and look at the ground. And what I see you shock will shock you even more. I feel as if a knife pierced my heart. Mitsuko! Mitsuko, my girlfriend, my love, is lying on the ground full of sword cuts. What? Travis, why? I... I trusted you. Loved you. No. This, this can't be real. I, I didn't do this. I'm horrified. My hands are trembling. What happened? Why is Misuko bleeding on the ground? And then I see it. I'm surrounded by Mitsuko corpses. Oh my god, all over? I 
I'm seeing flashbacks. I snapped. I slashed. I screamed. I killed them all. Oh my goodness. I killed the person I loved the most. Ah. Travis, Travis, what happened? Please wake up. I must be, I must be die. I must be, uh, possessed or something. I must be trapped in my own mind. I shall futile, futilely to my lover, who is lying on the ground, bleeding from the nose with a blank look in his eyes. Oh, man. That's scary. This is a nightmare. This is a nightmare. I don't want to lose him. I don't want to be abandoned again. Travis, you promised. Yeah, I did promise that. Can't let... I can't whatever's controlling my mind get the best of me. No, I need to calm down. He is still alive. I can feel that vital energy is still in his body. Yes, absolutely. But he's still. But he is so weak. The energy inside him is in turmoil. Oh God, that's not good. My other sight spoke for me, and I once again start checking the energies on Travis. My other side doesn't speak much, only in times of great joy or great stress. This is one such time. Well, absolutely. Travis! I can feel the tears in my eyes. But I calm myself down and look forward. Oh, jeez. Oh, my goodness. As soon as we... As soon as we arrived at the center of this anomalous area, this coffin appeared. And Travis fainted. Of course. It's that coffin. Of course. It's that coffin. It's that coffin that's doing all this damage to me. I immediately try to contact Looney, but this thing somehow cut off contact with the outside. Oh jeez, things are not looking good for me. I can't call for help. I tried attacking this coffin several times already, but all my attacks, even rituals made, made to attack ghosts or incorporeal beings, just passed right through it. Oh my goodness, what is going on? Curse you, give me my lover back. Stop, stop this. I shout out in I shout in rage even if I know it is futile. What can I do? What should I do? Huh? I hear a faint voice from somewhere. That's probably me. Is that me? I look down. Is this voice coming from Travis? It's probably coming from me. I suppose so. But the voice sounds different. Uh, 
Ooh. I look at the ring on Travis's right hand. It got a sword in, in ring form. Is it? Is it speaking to me? It probably is. You can help him. Just send your energy into me. Ellie's voice. The sword. I shake my head and I need to help Travis now. I touch the ring and send my energy over it. Hopefully, this will be enough to save him. It's all I can do. Travis, please, be safe. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to leave it right there. So, uh... So yeah, what I was doing during this... So what I was doing during this, uh... During this video is that I was trying to... Learn how to beat Soul. I mean, I know it's been like the past two series that since I last beat Soul. But I, uh, I need to look back at it. Like, I was tagged in one of the videos. But I don't remember who, what, I forgot who it was that tagged me. Showing me how to beat him. So, uh, whoever you are, um, help me. Because I suppose either tomorrow night on the Saturday night edition, on another Saturday night edition of Gacha Memories Redo 2024, or next week, uh, help me out. Alright guys, um, looks like I may not be getting a haircut tonight, and SML, some sort, didn't upload, didn't upload today, or tonight, but I guess he'll probably always upload tomorrow, and, uh, and Toy Blast, if my tablet is cooperative, it has enough filming time on it, and for that, we don't know. We don't know. We'll see what plays out. For now, you guys have a good night. Alright? Goodbye.